Welcome back girls and guys. I want to show you in this little clip um, how to assign things to an empty layer such as layer F. At the moment I've got nothing there and um, I want to have some control over things that are on different layers. For example, I've got my main inputs, my vocals, my bass guitar tracks and uh, the drum section is over there. So, and in layer C there is there are the effects returns Roop. and I've got some there are there's the DCA layer and some more inputs on layer B so I want to have some a custom layer and we do it the following way as you can see if I go on layer A all my input channels are there if I go back to layer F which is empty you can see nothing. So that's how it's supposed to be because there is nothing. How are we going to change that? We go to the setup button and now we want to change the surface so we touch the surface button and we've got this little neat screen there. So in the top row there are the things we have we can assign and on the bottom row there is the things I want to have on now uh, as you can see I'm assigning something to layer F. I can have inputs assigned, effects, mix and DCA or MIDI channels, MIDI strips. So let's say we want to have the vocals on one it's easy as yeah I've got the vocals there and I want to have next one and let's say I want to have some effects maybe oh see <laughs> I've done it wrong it's I'm right in the middle of the strip that's why the faders are coming up right there. I can show you right now how to delete them because I need to. I touch them and I take them out. Just like that. So we start light on strip one. Let's do that again. I go to the inputs and I simply drag and drop vocals, maybe the bass, tracks and uh, we want to have some effects there, effects sense or effects returns you can do, effects one and two and we want to have some control over the mixes so we take maybe auxiliary one oh, over there, Up. auxiliary two and maybe some DCAs. So, I have four left, so I take this DCA one. Oh, come on, two, three, and four. Let's do it again. There. So, and now my layer D is populated with all different funny things. I've got input layers, I've got effects, I've got DCAs. I've got auxiliaries there and I can mix from this fader bank only if I like to. See you next movie.